Just to type. What time do I apply my? It's also, you can see this line huh? for, for, for nitrogen. And you don't apply it. This trend. And uh, this is the yield. Kisema mazao. Namja ungea maneno ya weight. Hakuna kenyo mefa. It's likely to... Masa hizi tunamvua mingi. Ngependa wakulima wakivuna maindi. Wakue very cautious. Hili mvue zinyeshe ndani mingi ya rebike. We want to minimize losses za kuoza. Majua mbegu ukivuna, kioza, hauta pata mapato. So tunahomba serikali isirudie makosa. Afadhali watulete mbolea ya, ya yara. Na pia tunahomba serikali iweze kuweka hiyo yara fertilizer under subsidy program. Ili tuweze kuhangaika upande ya, pe, upande ya pempe njeo. Uh, this year we expected to produce enough seed for the country next season. And uh, the projections will come out because I know we are going to have almost 30 million kilos. That, that will be enough for next season. So if we reduce the losses, harvesting losses, then we expect to get beyond 30 million kilos, which is enough for the country. Uh, as population grows, there is a lot of pressure on land. So we want farmers to be able to adapt new technologies, to be able to uh, get good, very good yields in a small area. In this uh, program we, that we are working with, Yara, one of the products that uh, we are testing is a uh, biostimulant. Biostimulant are just, um, these are like biofertilizers. They are, they, they are substance which uh, improve the ability of uh, the crop to be able to utilize the nutrient, to be able to cope with the... Um, uh, stress, any stress which is abiotic, all biotic, and they are very key in uh, agricultural production. And actually, if we can embrace biostimulant, we can reduce the cost of production. Eh? We can reduce the use of uh, fertilizer by a significant uh, number. And uh, that would improve productivity and uh, make sure that we are producing at uh, a cost which is manageable to the farmers.